just, uh, my name is Wilma Staff. I was a counselor in the city of Regina, or an alderman at the time, from 1979 to 1985. Uh, and I have taken a keen interest ever since in what's going on in the city of Regina. And I am a municipal administrator, but I have retired, okay? I do understand the acts, and I will tell you as when the province of Saskatchewan declared the Cities Act in 2003, they gave municipalities an incredible amount of power, okay? And they're using that power. The people who are now elected can do pretty well what they want. The only way you can stop a lot of what's going on, not, I don't disagree with you in terms of getting people involved. Yes, people can make a difference. But you almost have to take them to court and sue. So that's where we run into a problem with these things. And now in Saskatchewan, they have four-year terms. <laughs> now, let me go to another point. Uh, Mr. Moise, you mentioned the fact that you need 10% of the uh, electorate of Regina in order to force a petition. In the Cities Act, there is a provision. You can force the mayor to hold a meeting on a, on a question of public interest with 5% of the population, that will give you an opportunity. I mean, if people get active, you could do it with 10,000, a little over 10,000. But be sure you do it correctly. Get a lawyer. Don't go out and, and put something together. Do it right. And I wanted to bring one other thing. I know this is not a question, but I think the people of Regina and the people in this room should be interested in a report that went to the executive committee. It's, uh, it came out of a private meeting of the executive committee. It's now on the city's website. It talks about debt. The city is looking to increase its debt by another $100 million for a stadium. They want either it to be considered by the municipal board and not be, a, not be added to the debt we, a debt we have already got approved, which is $350 million. But to add it would cost, we're now in a debt situation of approved debt to $450 million. So, and uh, people need to read this report. Basically it says, if we get into, into tough times and we have trouble paying the debt, uh, we can always raise the taxes and water rates. And I think you need to read this, because I just pulled it off the website today. It's tough to get it off, it's tough to print it out. You have to copy and edit, but it can be done. And by the way, the municipal board is appointed. Uh, this will be considered, this application, at the, um, they call it the local government committee. And uh, I, have, uh, I have the particulars. Uh, you can get in touch with the municipal board and it has to be there. I looked at the act, the municipal board act, they don't have to allow you to come in and, and be, if anybody who has an interest should be able to go. However, they don't have to allow this to be an open meeting. Anyway, I thought that that was important to tell people here tonight because I think this is a very important issue.